Right, good afternoon. Um, haven't been posting for a while because uh, what I'm doing is virtually the same as I've been doing, uh, I think, for the last four months, and that's uh, working on the Imperialist Army. Uh, and these are the plastic, once again, plastic lanchnecks from Warlord Games. I'm painting them up in batches um, because I'm going to paint up 64 figures and then mix them all together which will give me two 32-man pipe blocks and that will be pipe blocks number four and five of the project so far. Um, I'm trying to find the, the secret of quick painting land snakes and apart from undercoating in different colours, um, I think it's just uh, a slog. Uh, but once they're completed, um, I think the colours and the flags will... Uh, more than make up for the uh, sometimes, it's not dull painting, but um, it's it needs to be done. And uh, I look forward to getting them done eventually. Uh, so I think the first 12 were from a brown undercoat and I used the Army Painter uh, rattle cans for primer. Uh, and I've kept them, all the figures, rather, I wouldn't say subdued, but certainly not as fancy as... Well, I'm throwing fancy ones in there. Um, see that? Just block colours there. Um, so I paint the colours on. Agrax Earthshade Wash on these ones. Uh, and then just bring the colours up. And once again, spend more time on the flesh tones. So that was the first 12. Then I went to... Um, a armor. Oops, I just knocked that one over. Uh, the sorry, the I'm getting a bit all confused. Uh, no, there are there are. Yes, that's right. Plate, sorry, plate mail uh, spray can, which we gave this undercoat uh, because they were this next batch had. Breastplates and a few other bits. Wonky head. I said before that the figures aren't too bad. Um, those and then I sprayed white for the third batch a few more yellows in this lot And then today I've just finished another 11 for some reason. And I used a red undercoat with these. All much the same. Lilacs. So that's those. There you go. So next up, I will be pleased once these are done. Next up are two, four, six, eight. Another 11, for some reason, another 11. Uh, again, the 
silvery type undercoat. And then I'll just put the, paint the details on. Uh, there's more blacks and whites in this lot. Um, and then once they're done, that leaves me with 11 more and that'll be two pipe blocks and I won't say move on to other things, but um, just another couple of different units. I've got the, uh, in the stash now, I've got enough for 12 units on the Imperialist side, which will give me, I'll go into more detail later on, um, but we're getting there, certainly getting there. I think I've got enough now for the Imperialist to have three infantry divisions and at least one cavalry division. So um, yes, another couple of months, three months maybe. Uh, I've got a, a mind to push through this for the rest of the year because I want to do the French side, which obviously will be the, um, the involve the Swiss pike. Um, but that's the big picture. Uh, I'll go for another year, but who knows what's around the corner. Anyway, thanks for watching.